Hey, Tegna making a difference will make a difference day is one of the largest single days of service nationwide. It happens later this year, but we have an exciting announcement ahead of time. Tegna partnered with the Arby's Foundation to award more than a dozen volunteer organizations all across the country, and one of them is local. Our Tabney Dozier had the honor of surprising the Moving Forward Limb Loss Support Group of New Albany, Indiana. The surprise and their mission right now. From a seven-year-old local elementary school student to an elderly man who faced complications from surgery, the Moving Forward Limb Loss Support Group extends its services to any and everyone. But at this particular meeting, they had no clue of our plans to let them know how much their work is appreciated. Is this the Moving Forward Limb Loss it Support is. Group? Okay. The entrance and the delivery. And we would like to present Moving Forward Limb Loss Support Group with a $10,000 Thanks to the Arby's Foundation, Points of Light, and Tegna, this Kentuckiana gym is being honored. If we could do something to help prevent even one person from losing a limb, we wanted to do that. Moving Forward Limb Loss Support Group helps Kentuckiana amputees and their families. Belinda Jacoby applied for the grant last fall, but had to keep the secret that they won. It's helping people who have suffered tremendously. An aneurysm in my heart and doing surgery uh, oxygen got cut off from my uh, limbs and caused them to die. So I have a lot of scarring and things like that, and they said that what was happening on the outside to my skin, which was turning black from the gangrene setting in and the blood clotting, um, they said, I know, they said that it was going to affect my organs, that if I even made it, I'd be a vegetable. Story after story of survival, when doctors even had counted them out. It's between these walls that amputees find comfort and kindness. And when I'm in the street, the pants leg are uh, down because I'm trying to blend in with, with others. But here I can let my hair down and be just like everybody else. It's been a wonderful experience. Well, we're here not even just for the amputees, but for the caregivers because you know, my mom, I, I mean, we didn't have Google and the Facebook when I was a kid, and I didn't have the network like anything like this. Looks like it was a very well-deserved uh, award for that group, and I think from what I've seen today at, at this gathering, I think it's going to make some difference in a lot of people's lives. Making a difference day, it's not just 24 hours. It's an initiative. It's a movement. Treat people nicely. Mm -hmm. And you can see the action and dedication in groups just like this one. We want to thank all of the hands that made this give back possible. If you would like to get involved or learn more about the Moving Forward Limb Loss Group, just click on this story on our website. That's whas11.com. I'm Tabney Dozier, WHAS 11 News.